Hey YouTube, aka Soggy Buns, and in this video I just want to show you Wemos D1 Mini. It's an awesome little board, it's an ESP8266 with a Wi-Fi enabled board. Uh, you can program it using Arduino. Uh, has some pinouts on it, and I knew that I wanted to do something with it, and I was looking on Amazon and I saw this cool little deal. It's with uh, this TFT screen, it's a 1.44 inch, it's 128 by 128 resolution, you just saw it in the B-roll. And I thought, whoa, this is pretty cool. Um, I think I got it even cheaper than it's showing now. Right now it's showing $14.99, I think I got it for $12 or $10. And that was even including with the Prime shipping, so that was pretty neat. The problem was that when I got it, there isn't much on here about how to set it up. I mean, there is this their YouTube video right here and I mean and he did a pretty good job he, he gave a good job on on how to flash it nothing on really how to hook up this TFT screen to pinout board and I did a, a quite a bit of digging so he did a pretty good job on showing how to do it but nothing on really how to hook up this TFT screen to the Wemos um, I mean, you can kind of see they have a wire turned the picture, but nothing, nothing to really show there. I found this library. It is the Adafruit ST7735 library. Uh, it helped out a lot. I'm so grateful that it, Adafruit does these things on on uh, GitHub, and they get, they do great tutorials on how to work with their videos or work with their products. So the code. made a couple adjustments to it you actually um, it's kinda cool on the D1 Mini here I'll go back and show you it's actually labeled and you can see it's labeled uh, D1, D2, D3 uh, reset, E0, 3 volt, 5 volt uh, transmit, receive so that actually helped out a lot so what you had to do is on the screen it has ground, BCC, SCL, SDA, reset, DC, CS, backlight. And so I changed uh, CS, that goes to pin D1, reset goes to D0, uh, DC goes to D2, and then you come at this line here, and you want to use this one, come out that one. And then it will use our CSTFT and our reset. Now, if you notice in the the video, there's still a little static line. It's because the resolution isn't quite right, and I haven't been able to find a fix. So as soon as I find a fix for that, update it. So 